Holy Spirit. Amen. May the God who has given us the power over the works of His hands be with you all. In His own life, Christ clearly showed us the dignity of the Lord. In the incarnate the Word of the Father, was known as our carpenter's son, and willingly worked with the tools of His trade. By working with His own hands, He transformed toil from being an inherited curse for sin into the source of blessing. If we do our work well, whatever it may be, and offer it to God, we purify ourselves, and through the labor of our hands and minds, we build up God's creation. Our work enables us to practice charity and to help the less fortunate, so that joined to Christ the Redeemer, we grow in His love. And let us bless the Lord then and pray that He will shower His blessings on all will work in this place. The Lord be with you. The proclamation from the Holy Gospel according to Saint Glory to you, Lord. Another, bless you with His presence and look kindly on all who enter here and benefit your service. We ask this blessing in Jesus' name. Amen. And may the Almighty and loving God bless you and your family with abundant blessings of heaven and earth. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Congratulations. Congratulations. Kalakpak. 3 million dong to eh. Ah, talaga 3 million dong. helmet na may Swarovski crystal. Right. Tag tatlong million na helmet. Bet na miss nga lang. Bet na miss currency. <laughs> What's up mga chong? So by now, nakapag-upload na tayo ng year in review natin sa taong 2020. Kung hindi nyo pa napapanood, the link is right up here. Uh, just kindly click on that so you can watch Garage King PH's year in review. Alam naman natin, medyo masalimuot ang ating 2020. Right? Sinimulan tayo ng pagkamatay ni Kobe Bryant, pagpatok ng taal, yung pandemic, of course, that's the big story of 2020. Pero, the good things naman ay hindi na wala, of course. Nasimulan natin ang channel natin. Uh, later on, bago matapos ang taon, naiimbitan tayo sa mga events, sa mga kasama natin sa industriya ng pagmumotor at ng mga sasakyan. Hindi na naiiba dyan yung inattendan natin last December 29. Ito yung opening ni Vintage Rider Manila. Yan o. Vintage Rider Manila. Na-interview natin yung owner, si Mr. Ped Faitaren, si attorney. Let's hear a few words from Sir Ped kung sino ba si Vintage Rider Manila. Hello sir, magandang araw po sa lahat na nanonood po ng Garage King PH and welcome to our humble store, Vintage Rider Manila po at saka VRM Helmets. Ito po kami sa Tiendesita. Ang VRM Helmets po, it's a proudly Filipino brand ng helmet. VRM actually stands for Vintage Rider Manila. Sarili po natin siyang brand. Although ang manufacturing po namin is currently in Thailand. So our helmets are TIS rated which is equivalent to ACE. Uh, lahat po ng helmets natin dito, dumaan po ng DTI, all have ICC stickers, government approved, safe naman po. I was really stoked to attend this um, event kasi ang daming dumating dito. Uh, personalities sa mundo ng mga motorsiklo kasi Sir Ped, kung hindi nyo na itatanong, eh, rider yan. <laughs> Lihiti mong rider yan. Uh, he rides a Royal Enfield. The model is not quite on top of my head right now. Pero yun, uh, kaya siya vintage rider. Kasi talagang vintage yung niraride niya. Vintage vibes, yeah? So, there you go. Um, it's located in Tiendesitas, second level. Building A, kung hindi ako nagkakamali. Please, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, okay? But, uh, yeah, Building A. Tiendesitas, Pasig City, kung magagawi kayo sa area. At naghahanap-hanap kayo ng helmet para sa inyong classic na motor. Actually, hindi lang pang classic. Ang dami dyan. Tignan nyo. So, ito po yung pinaka-basic natin na helmet. Ito po yung VRM Classics. As you can see, the black gum line, tapos uh, naka-train po siya na black, mayroon po siyang goggles siya. Ito po yung pinaka-basic namin ni Helmet. And now we have others, no? Meron po tayo yung mga premium natin. Ito po, mas maganda po yung kanilang trim, mas maganda po yung padding, brass buttons na po, tapos leather goggles siya. Now, ang pinaka-bago namin mga helmet na ngayon lang po kami nagkaroon, it's our very own, our first na full face helmet po, no? So, classic po siya. This is the VRM Milano. Good helmet, actually. Yung weight niya, hindi masyadong mabigat. Kung marinig mo, nag-click po ito, no? Kung nag-click siya. Ganyan po tayong buttons. Yung may vent din po ito, pero yung vent niya ay nasa loob yung switch. May exhaust din. 
Tapos, meron po siyang ano, pan-divert ng ulan dito sa gilid. So, although it's a classic style helmet, meron na rin siyang modern amenities. So, namin, ito yung flagship namin for this year. Right, thank you so much. Support local. <laughs> Tignan nyo naman yung collection ng mga helmet na pwede nyo mabili dyan. Punta na kayo dyan cause nandyan din ang Royal Helmet, ang Gile. By the way, Royal Helmet, kumusta kayo dyan? Uh, Royal Helmet PH. Maraming salamat for choosing to work with me. Hinihintay ko lang po, magkakaroon tayo ng review sa mga produkto ni Royal Helmet. Bukod pa syempre dun sa gamit-gamit natin na Royal H1. Yeah? So, Royal Helmet PH, what's up? Again, kung magagawi kayo ng Tiendesitas, Pasig City, daan na kayo dito sa Vintage Rider Manila. They're officially open. Mall hours, of course. By the way, mabanggit ko na rin, no? May mga shirt dyan na pwede nyo rin mabili. Mga riding jersey. Siyempre, bilang isang community lang naman tayo sa motorcycling community, nag-display na rin kami dyan. So, si Garage King PH, yung shirt natin, at itong mga to, Drive It Master Republic, is also available in Vintage Rider Manila in Tiendesitas. Unang beses kong makapag-display sa mall yan, mga chong. Kaya kung gusto nyo ng shirt ni Garage King PH, kuha na kayo dyan or bisita na kayo dyan. So yeah, hindi naman puro sa limot ang dinala sa atin ng 2020 dahil bago matapos ang taon. Masayang-masaya tayo dahil may Pinoy brand, yeah, ang VRM. Patuloy na lumalago ang negosyo. Nakakatuwa yan. Sa makatuwid, hindi kami pinauwi ni Sir Ped na walang bit-bit. <laughs> Let me just take these out. Bago kami umuwi ni Drive It Master, pinabaunan kami ni Vintage Rider Manila ng goodies, which is ooh, what is this? Mug? Yeah, boy! Take a look at that. Iyan yung isa sa mga helmet nila. At iyan ang logo ni Vintage Rider Manila. Yeah? Ang ganda mga chong. So, I have a nice cup. Put that aside. And another one. Ano naman kaya to? So, Vintage Rider Manila rin. At ito yung flagship helmet nila, the Vintage Rider Milano. Let's take a look at that in actual. Yes! Yan ang VRM Milano. Bukot pa dun, napakabay talaga ni Sir Pen. Kinadala niya rin tayo ng, what is this? Helmet hook? Yan! Mounting hardware pa. So, yan. Vintage Rider Manila. Pero focus ka naman. Ayan. So, your helmet goes right here. Ilalagay mo siyang ganun. Tapos, yung coat mo or yung jacket mo, i-hanger mo siya dyan. You know how it works? Sa pader, di ba? Saktong-sakto to dahil may parating tayong bagong bahay. <laughs> Hopefully, this year, sa garage natin, napakagandang uh, accessory nito doon. And it's very functional. Got two. Yeah? Thank you so much, Vintage Rider Manila. And we also had some raffle nung nandun tayo. May mga nanalo sa raffle natin. Congratulations. I hope by now, you've already claimed your prize na migay tayo ng dalawang helmet. Ang nanalo po ng ating VRM uh, helmet ay si Ma'am Marian D. Congratulations, Ma'am Marian D. Nanalo po kayo ng Vintage Rider Manila na helmet. I-claim nyo lang po dito sa kanilang store. Located at second level. Uh, Tiendesitas, Pasig City, Building A. Punta lang po kayo dito. I'm sure, pag nandito ka na, marami ka pang magugustuhan. At ayan, I hope you like this episode of Garage King PH. Nakakatuwa dahil may kasama tayo sa industriya na thriving ang negosyo despite pandemic. And kung kayo, may sinimulang kayo negosyo, uh, good luck sa inyo. I hope this year is gonna be the year for redemption. I hope rest back here to para sa ating lahat and mabuhay kayo. This has been your Garage King PH. Matik na yan as usual. You ride safe and you drive safe. Ciao!